gonna how to make an emergency fire at least two or three times as long as the chapstick tube then i'm gonna push chapstick. out all of the chapstick and take it out now i need it to melt into a liquid so i'll put it in this pot rake some hot coals out from my fire and then put the pot on top of that so while that melts i'm gonna cut the bottom off of my okay maybe this isn't tube. making a fire i'll take the wrapper off then I'll take I my section of t-shirt and then twist it up into the tube. I'll push it all the way through and then Let's soak does, a few guys. inches of it with the melted chapstick. You could also rub it into the shirt without melting it. This just helps it soak in a little better. I'll let it dry and then trim it up some. Now I'll give this a light and show you how it works. It's wind and water resistant so you can use it to help you get a fire going in bad weather conditions. Oh, I see. Okay. You can make okay. it and keep it with you for it's an, an emergency, emergency lighter. situation. You just pull it back through to extinguish it. Then you can keep reusing it. And if you really had to, you could just burn the entire thing. 